Where are we going? Somewhere where you're going to murder me by the looks of it. Yeah. Go on, keep going then. Are you nervous? I actually am. Can I park anywhere? Yeah, just park it anywhere. Oh my god! We got a little cabin. That's so cute! Taking me to the middle of nowhere to murder me. <laughs> yes, I have. <laughs> Look, there's even petrol to burn you with. There's a log burner in the back. Just wait, you haven't seen that in years. Right, we'll look at the views first. Okay. This is just the main side. Okay. Hold view. on, let me turn it around. Oh, this is this is nothing. This is nothing. Basically, we are in the Cotswolds. I hope you can hear me over the car. We're in the Cotswolds in a little Airbnb called The Cabin. I'll get Ben to tell you a little bit more about that, like how we found it and stuff um, later, but it's literally in the middle of a field. It's stunning. It's so quiet. There not, isn't even any like wind or anything here. It's amazing. But this is the car um, for the week and the cabin for the next few days is my 30th birthday present from Ben. And I think this is such a nice idea because like, I feel like this is so much more meaningful than an actual thing. Do you know what I mean? Like it's making memories rather than an object. Does that make sense? I don't know how to explain it. I feel like, I don't know if I should stop, stop running the car or not. Here he comes. cigarette stuff at home. And he's very grumpy with our cigarette stuff. Yes I am. 
Okay, let's go find our way back to the cabin. We've got to turn around. Yeah, I know. I did realise that. Ah, uh, you'll be alright. I'll be fine. I was going to vlog in Banbury, but I got very anxious after trying to drive the car into a car park, so I didn't. But we went charity shop shopping, didn't we? Mm -hmm. And it was actually really successful, so I thought we would show you what we got. So we went to... No. That didn't sound good. <sighs> went into Wood Green charity shop and it was like 10 DVDs for a pound. So we got 10 DVDs, because why not? Case is broken. So we got... Remember Me, Bogota. White Chicks, Bogota. Transformers, Bogota. Pursuit of Happiness, actually a really good film if you haven't seen that one, Bogota. Notting Hill, which is one of my faves, oh I got a book, I got the best new, best new horror and it's like from the gist I can get, it's lots of different stories by different authors but I thought that would be quite good because it's like lots of short stories and I have a really short attention span. But that was a pound. Love that. Shaun of the Dead. Well, Fight Club, which I've never seen. Well, Dark Knight. Good Coach Carter. Good and Troy. I decided that I just wanted small, like small, weird, random crap. You did. Um, so we got some small, weird, random crap. We got <laughs> some masks. So on our stairs, are you thinking on the stairs for this? I don't know. Okay. That's where I pictured it. On our stairs, if you saw the house tour, we're planning on having all of the walls with like random artwork and stuff. So that's kind of where I'm picturing this to go as a random. It's actually really creepy. It is, isn't it? Yeah. We've got a um, Stilton jar. I might use this as a sugar jar, put sugar in it. A fish egg cup. We've got a fish egg cup. So we set ourselves the challenge to get one of the weirdest things, but this was hand painted in Cyprus. I thought that was actually quite cool. We've got like little tiny, tiny bird frames. Oh yeah, these are really sweet. This one's a robin. Birdies. Oh, it is. Well, I mean they're tiny, put your hands next to it. Like they're tiny. Put it next to my head. I have a small head. A giant head. A tiny head. Uh, then you got your book, didn't you? Yeah, I was actually really happy with this. So, I don't know if anyone will actually remember it because it's a really, really old film, but I used to watch a film called Swiss Family Robinson, and it was about a family who got shipwrecked on an island and then like, built a massive, amazing tree house and had an elephant as a pet. And I used to watch it, or I'd watched it with my granddad before, and I found the book. So... I couldn't not get it, and it was only five pounds. Although, no, it was one pound. Who, who, although whoever bought it before only paid one pound. <laughs> go back there. <laughs> yeah, and then we've got a set of books. We love really old books, but this is a set of um, what was it called? The bedside books the, of. Yeah, the bedside books of, and we've got the bedside book of uh, biography, the bedside book of adventure, the bedside book of laughter, the bedside book of discoveries. The bedside book of nature and the bedside book of the living of the art of living. 
and they came in a little set and this was only £15. How cute are these? I haven't actually looked inside any of these, you just bought them. <laughs> cute. Oh, there's cute little illustrations. And then we got some vinyls again. Buddy Holly. We got the Buddy Holly story, because I love Buddy Holly. Then we got the magnificent John Cash. Cool. Hey, her isn't on here. It's not? No. Yeah. And then we got some newer ones. So Ben got Bring Me to the Horizon and Tom Walker. For any Bring Me the Horizon fan, I do apologise <laughs> for what Cara just said. Um, it's Bring Me the Horizon, not Bring Me to the Horizon. But that doesn't make sense. It's mm -hmm. what? It's from um, Pirates of the Caribbean. In, uh, at the end of the Black Pearl, Captain Jack Sparrow goes, uh, Bring Me that Horizon. Is that where they got the idea from? Yeah, and then they called it Bring Me the Horizon. Because mm. I don't think they could directly, I don't know. How. I'm just guessing here, but yeah, that, that is apparently the reason why they did it. So yeah, Bring Me the Horizon, Sempaternal. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> that was our little haul. And then we, there was a little clip that I did when we got some food. Um, it was a place called, the, was it called The Locker? No, it was Lock 39, because it was on the 39th lock along that river. Oh yeah. Um, a canal. But it's like a little inside market. Yeah, yeah. We went to Smash Cow. Yeah, and it was actually really good. Sorry to any vegans. <sighs> it was actually really good. Yeah, they do do vegan burgers to be fair actually, mm. so I'll take back my apology. And they did a, a Biscoff... Biscoff bacon burger. Biscoff bacon burger, of which neither of us... I just had chips, but what did you get? I got spicy chorizo burger, it's actually quite good. Mm. Tasted spicy and chorizo -y. That's good. That's yeah. our little shopping haul. So I swear we got more. I did feel like we got more, but clearly we didn't. We're going to do. Um, and then, uh, and then that was it. And then we got food, didn't we? I'm like, I'm going to have going to do dirty fine. Ow. <laughs> Just clean the floor. It's dirty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was it. Because then we got food. Yeah. Yeah. We had a little conversation with a random lady, didn't we? Yeah, turns out her, so obviously being in Banbury, we're nowhere near where we're from. Bumped into a lady and her mum literally lives down the road. Yeah. That was a little random. She was a nice, very sweet lady. Yeah, I thought she was going to have a go at us at first. I know. No, she was all right. So now we're going to have a little tea break. Have a nap. Have a nap. And then probably go for a little walk because there's a walk around the fields here that goes down to the pub. So then we're going to go have a drink. Sorry, at the pub. Mm -hmm. And Ben's going to have his nap here. And then just have a chilled, chilled night. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so tired. <laughs> we decided not to go for a walk because we both sat down on the sofa and the sofa's really comfy. So the walk didn't happen. So I just got a message literally just now from the person that's looking after Delilah, um, Jack. Thank you, Jack, by the way, if Thank you're watching. Jack. Um, Delilah has um, shit on her head. What? Delilah's got shit on her head. <laughs> How has she done that? I don't know. Let me see if this is in the picture. When's Delilah? What's Delilah like in the bath? She has turd on her head. <laughs> oh, my God. Let me, let me put you in. Okay. <laughs> Oh bless him, he's doing us a massive favour and now he needs to give Delilah a bar. <laughs> yeah, so we put a film and we watched Notting Hill, one of my faves. Absolutely love that film, such a comfort film. What's your favourite comfort film? <laughs> and now Ben's cooking dinner and it's just been so chilled. Like, it's just so nice to come somewhere where like no one can turn up at the house or randomly ring and be like, oh, what are you doing? Do you, you know, it's like, not that you don't want to do something, but sometimes it's nice to just not have to say no, if you know what I mean. If you flick that down, and then that will be the, ha like the handle that you can take off. Um, and then to turn the shell on the twisty knob, you just twist it the whole way around. Um, you may have to do, you might have to play with the heat, um, just because it would be boiling hot because of Kara. Oi! Um, but yeah, um, yeah, she is, she is alright in the, um, 
shower. She's fine in the shower. What's it got? <gasps> it's got a little mouse. It's got a vole. No, it's not. I love foxes, but I felt really helpless just then because it was thrown around a field mouse, like up in the air, wasn't it? Yeah, literally a proper dash Like throwing there. it over the top and it was hitting its back. And part of me really wanted to go out and save the mouse, but the other part was like, but the fox needs to eat. You've got the good lighting, I look like I'm fucking... That's because I know where the lighting's at, boy. Say goodbye. Keep going. I don't want to leave. It's been so incredibly peaceful here, but exactly what we both needed. It's quite windy and chilly today, so actually it's probably a good job that we're going home today. But I'm excited to go and see Delilah. I'll film as we go in. I don't really know what her reaction is going to be because this is the first time we've um, left her with someone else like, overnight. So we'll see. We'll see her reaction when we get inside. But yeah, I'm just packing up the car and then we're gonna head home. Goodbye to the cabin. <sighs> Fit quite a lot in a figure, right? Silence. Hi. 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 Hi.
have a lovely, a lovely voice. I'm so tired this morning. Oh, no, you know when you're so tired that you become like slightly delirious? That's kind of how I felt last night. Like it just felt like I was in a film. I don't know how to explain it, but I was so tired. Um, also, the camera phone doesn't like no bright lights, so yeah. Anyway. It's my birthday. 29 plus 1.